So first of all, we've got these ground mats, which we lay down for the track. It comes really into play, especially when you're shooting on uh, snow, grass, gravel, uh, and you just need to have more of an even surface. These definitely come in handy. So these are uh, toolless connections. So you basically just need to snap them together. Think of really high quality industrial tent poles going together. This is a module design. So you can actually get more of these lengths and stick them together to make it even longer if you needed to. So that might come in handy down the road. You can start with this size and then grow up uh, as you need. It takes me about two minutes to do it by myself, uh, even quicker if you have a second hand. But it's nice to know because sometimes I show up on location and I don't have any help that I can do it by myself. So uh, since we're not on a slippery surface, we're out here on concrete, you don't need the end feet that come with it. But it is nice, as you'll see, not to have those cross ties uh, for being able to walk freely down the track. This is a travel dolly track. So it is designed to set up quickly and move around easily. So this is some heavy duty metal, but this can definitely handle uh, a heavier tripod or a light jib as well. This track is smooth, I'm talking butter. And because there's no cross ties uh, connecting the, the, the rails, you're able to walk down the middle of the track with your tripod and not worry about tripping. So there are other brands out there, as you might be aware of, and I've used a few of them, and this Pro-Am Swift Dolly definitely ranks uh, with the top.